Welcome to the Urban Survivor channel and in this video I'm going to be sharing an everyday carry blackout kit that's small enough to be kept inside of a backpack and capable of providing illumination, charging your cell phone, and helping you stay informed in the event of an emergency. All of the items in this kit combined provide over 12,316 hours of light, which is just over 513 days. So if you're looking for some items with great run times to add to your everyday carry, this video will show you some great options to consider. When I was putting this kit together, I needed to find an organizer with plenty of elastic webbing that was thick enough for a lot of items to comfortably nest inside, so I settled on the Maxpedition Skinny. The Skinny is deeper and longer than a lot of similar pocket organizers on the market, and there's plenty of room in here for the items that I included. It also has has a clamshell style opening so when you open it it's easy to see and access the items stored inside. So for this kit I picked lights that could be powered with common battery types rather than something like 18650s or CR123s so most of the lights in this kit can run on a single AA battery. The primary flashlight is the Skill Hunt M150 V2 and in addition to running on a single AA it also comes with a 3.6 volt 14500 battery which helps the light to achieve maximum output of 750 lumens and a max beam distance of 110 meters and as you can see it's got a medium beam angle and a small spill. One reason I really like this light is the fact that it has an ultra low 0.2 lumen moonlight mode and is capable for running for about 55 days straight on a single AA battery which makes it perfect for extended use. For the times when you need to use both hands, the LED Lenser ML4 is an excellent lantern that also runs on an included 14500 or a single AA battery. This is the warm version of the ML4, which produces a very soft and smoothly diffused light, perfect for lighting up small spaces. It has a few different output modes, including a boost with a max output of 300 lumens and a low five lumen mode, which has a max run time of 40 hours. The ML4 also has a red mode, which is great for keeping a low profile and preserving your night vision. And it can also be useful for signaling. It also has a carabiner style hook, which you can use to hang it. Another hands-free lighting tool that I'm really fond of is the Thrunite TH20 and in my opinion it's one of the best performing budget-friendly headlamps you can buy. The TH20 is compatible with both a 14500 and a AA battery and it comes with a rubber mount which you can use to adjust the direction of the beam up and down and also an elastic headband. It has a max output of 520 lumens with a 14500 and 250 lumens using a AA. This headlamp has an impressive firefly mode with the 0.3 lumen output and it's capable of running for 14 days on a AA battery. This is a new item that I was really excited to add to the kit, which is the Thrunite TS2. The TS2 is a lantern and a signal light, which also doubles as a power bank, which you can use to charge your phone and other USB powered devices. The TS2 is powered by a 5000 milliamp hour 21700 battery, which can easily be removed from the plastic housing, and you can take off the head and use it to charge your devices with the included 3 in 1 USB charging cable that has a USB C a micro USB and a lightning cable. It has a high mode with 118 lumens and a max run time of 11 hours and a low mode with five lumens and a max run time of 180 hours. It also has an SOS mode, which has a runtime of 20 hours. The TS2 has a magnetic base, which you can use to attach it to magnetic surfaces and also a magnetic carabiner clip, which you can use to hang the TS2 as well. Having a power bank can come in handy for keeping smartphones and other electronics including many of the items in this kit charged. And one of my favorites is the Nightcore NB10,000. This 10,000 milliamp hour power bank can charge most modern smartphones twice. It has a carbon fiber body, and it's also extremely thin and lightweight, weighing in at just 5.29 ounces, which makes it much lighter than most other power banks with the same capacity. It has a USB-C quick charge 3.0 input output, and gives you the ability to charge devices incredibly quickly, but it also has a low current mode, which is suitable for more sensitive devices. It also has a USB-A output and can be used to charge two devices simultaneously. There's also a mode button and a battery life indicator, which lets you know approximately how much battery life remains in the NB10000. Being connected to local news could be very important during an emergency situation. And you can't always rely on your phone to work, which is why I keep an Eton Grundig M400 receiver radio in the kit as well. It's a simple radio that runs on two AAA batteries and has a built-in telescoping antenna and receives AM and FM signals, which typically can pick up local news, and also shortwave 1 and 2, which can be received at much longer ranges. I also keep 8 spare AA batteries, which can be used in the Skill Hunt M150, the ML4, and the TH20, 
and four AAA batteries, which can be used to power the grunting radio. I also keep some charging cables in this kit, which can be used to charge my smartphone, flashlight, lantern, and other small USB powered devices, and a set of earbuds, which can connect to the radio and help preserve the battery life. All right, so now I'm gonna tally up the max runtime of these lights to see how many hours of runtime you can get if you use the items in this kit on their lowest output setting. The Skillhunt M150 can run for an impressive 1200 hours, which is 50 days on a 14500 battery. The Thrunite TH20 can run for 336 hours on a single AA. The Amla 4 Warm can run for 40 hours on its included 14500 battery. The Thrunite TS2 can run for 180 hours on its lowest output. I've also got 8 AA's in this kit. And if I really wanted to maximize runtime, I'd use them all in the Skillhunt M150, which would add 10,560 hours of runtime to the kit for a grand total of 12,316 hours, which is just over 513 days. The Skillhunt M150 and the Lenlenser ML4 could also be charged with the Nightcore NB10,000 to further extend their battery life. Hopefully this video gave you some good ideas of the items you can add to your everyday carry blackout kit. Let me know your thoughts on this kit in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching and until next time.